realizing that when they hurt you, hurt them back. Stop, stop looking for all this, you know, uh, marching and civil rights and turn the other cheek because they don't feel that way. You know what I'm saying? They'll continue to press on you until you back in the corner and you leech out and hurt one of them. And that's when they'll start leaving you alone. But how are we, how are we going to hurt them economically, being a disenfranchised people without very much money on the whole? You know what? If, if, if the black people ever figured out or sat down and calculated how much money they make, they would be the third richest nation in the world. Black people in the Western Hemisphere make more money than most foreign countries. You make more money than France as a whole country, blacks alone. They just don't know the power they have. And the way to hit them is stop working for them and start working for self and kind. Start doing things, start building business from the inside out. Stop giving yourself to them as slaves and then expecting them to treat you, then, treat you other than a slave. If you, want them, if you want to be treated like a slave, keep working for them. As long as you work for them, you're still a slave. Or you got to look at the book of Revelations in an 18th chapter, tell you that they want the slaves and the souls of men. And they rule them by a form of sorcery. If all the